what's up everybody this is Bill I don't exactly have my tripod handy I'm getting the uh, Android 4.1.2 jelly bean update uh, right now this says battery is too low to install system update so I'll go connect the charger but uh, what I did Android is upgrading we're going to jump ahead. I'm going to show you how to get your Nexus 7 to upgrade itself. If you haven't already gotten the Android 4.1.2 Jelly Bean update, keep watching this video. I'm going to show you how you can go get it without doing a single thing besides going into settings on your Nexus 7. All right, everyone. I'm going to go over a little something here. I got my uh, Nexus 7. So I'll show you what this looks like here. Allow Google's location service. Agreed. This is what you're going to have to press after you get it to do this update. So what we're going to do is I have an app already installed. So we're going to go in here. And I have ultimate rotation control. I'm going to show you here. Rotate. We're going to take rotate. We're going to uninstall it. Here we go. Rotating home screen. Android 4.1.2 Jelly Bean Update. Just came to my Nexus 7. So now as you can see up here, you have the option to lock. So you can lock it, which you had before, but now, say you rotate it and you want it to stay like that. Hit your lock button. Now it will not rotate back. So what I'm going to show you is how to force your Nexus 7 to do this Jelly Bean update. Another thing that this update came with is if you use one finger to slide down when you get an email or some other notifications, you can use one finger to slide down. I don't have an email on here to show you. Hopefully we'll get one during the video. So that'll open up your email, one finger to slide it back up from what I've been told. So, what we're going to do today is we're going to go into settings. You can get your Nexus 7 out and follow me right along. We're going to go into settings. We're going to go into apps. We are going to go over here to all. Okay. So we're at all. Let's zoom this in just a little bit here. Okay, there we go. So now we're in all on the system settings, or app settings, excuse me. We are going to go right down here to we're gonna find it here. Google Services Framework. I want you to go to Google Services Framework. You're going to force stop and do it in this order. It won't work. Force stop, clear data. Then you're going to back up, back up, come all the way down here to about tablet, system updates, check now. You should come up with the update to go to this. Android 4.1.2 Jelly Bean. Open, open, everything opened. Hold down, down, up, up, closed. Did you catch that? Leave a comment, let me know what you think. Have a great day. What's up everybody? This is Bill. Uh, I'm glad you are subscribing to my YouTube channel. Uh, continue to watch my videos. Uploading new stuff every couple days. I find all kinds of stuff to upload. I try to keep YouTube busy. Uh, if you want to follow me, you can find me uh, right over there on Instagram. Uh, you can follow me right up that way on Twitter and right over there on Facebook. And I'm also on Google Plus right there. Anyways, hope you continue to watch my videos. Uh, go ahead and give me the like button, give me the thumbs up, uh, hit that plus one button down there, and uh, make sure you read my description. I try to keep important information down there. 
Anyways, stay tuned for more videos. Deuces. Thanks for subscribing.